Whoa. Oh, hi. All right. Uh. Right. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Well, let's just start somewhere, I guess. That's the really... The only answer I have is just to start somewhere. Maybe that's a good idea. So, we'll just take these off. Just putting on some, like, gloves. But I know that's probably not going to help with my grip on the controllers. So I'll just go ahead and take those off. There we go. Primary focus, as always, is to try and find ammo. Which is always a struggle. Ammo is like the hardest thing to come by, I guess, in the radius. So, we're gonna... We're gonna go all the way. We're gonna take the far left entrance into a uh, Blotky Village. Which is over here by train yard. <clears throat> Hello, Apiris. Good to see you. I already looted all of this over here. Eh, I got two still the radius flips. I think I fixed it so that I actually... I think I removed one of the mods that changed time scaling. <sighs> yeah, I did. I did remove that mod because time is now moving a lot faster. I just decided that it would be better to do it that way. So every, like, every minute in game is, like, very short. Yeah, like 10 seconds, almost. Which might be bad, but eh, it's fine. Oh, hey. Hey. Give. That's a good mag. It's a mag I need for my gun. Oh, and I'm over here. Sweet. Uh, uh, hey, another one. And some buckshot ammo. Good. Good, good, good. Starting off strong. Not hello. I am back. Uh, no FT this week. Fractured Thrones is coming back next week. Brunswick is still recovering from his, uh, back pain. So, that's kind of why we're not having any 
Uh, role play. So I'm kind of just free to do whatever I want, which is upsetting because I really like FT. That's a uh, 357. 357 Magnum. Alright, so I'm gonna guess a bunch of enemies have spawned over here now because of the mission. M2. M2 and then M4 is a Kurt is samples. Alright. But yeah. I don't know. I'm probably I'm gonna stream today and then tomorrow I might stream. It actually did jam. No, it didn't jam. That's what I was saying. Running out of all my ammo types. One bullet. Got it. I fucking <laughs> I thought I was too I thought I was far enough away but yes you can <laughs> I got that achievement yay I got the kill your get die in the radius achievement and I lost everything <sighs> so I have to go back and get my death get all my stuff no great uh, let's run with you. 9 by 18. Uh, I have a bit of 9 by 18. Oh, fucking hell. I screwed up. I was trying to kill the spawn. Because that's also an achievement. I was like, my brain just went to, hey, that's an achievement. Kill, a, kill an enemy with an explosion. And that's the first thing that came to my mind, is like, hey, I should try to kill this thing. <sighs> well, you win some, you lose some. I just gotta bring this with me. Oh. I'll grab one of these. One of these. Oh, I died. 
fuck? All right. Yeah, hopefully his back gets straightened out by next week. Yeah. It's just he's recovering slowly, that's all. The body takes a while to recover. Ah, <sighs> fuck no. Can't believe I got myself killed because I was being an idiot. <laughs> well, I got an achievement that I was not hoping to get for a long time. <laughs> That's all right. Should be on the right thing, right? Um Huh? Yeah, hi. Okay. I just had to make sure. I had to make sure my shit was working. All the way back. I don't even have probes. I don't even have a knife. I was just gonna go in with a gun and grab my stuff back. Recollect my items. We're going going in light. It's most of the case there was just like the the mimic policeman and a spawn over there. I don't know if there was anything else, but there probably was. I think, what are the, what are the, the, uh, spawn, fragment, mimics, seeker, those guys, those are the, those are the annoying enemy types. <clears throat> Damn it, I just found like a bunch of magazines for, uh, that TT-33 that I'm starting to use. Since I have a lot of seven by seven six two by twenty five, which is what that pistol takes. As we get to the next area, we'll walk. Oh, we'll just walk right now. No more sprinting. Yep, there's my death. X marks the spot. So we'll just walk so we can regain our stamina. And there's a beacon I can see through the world. First time I've ever died in this game of the, like, 30-something hours I have in this game. I don't remember. First time I've ever died. Well, I well my main save that I was that I first my vanilla save was, I think on easy difficulty. So, and now I'm playing on normal. It's all my body is white. Oh my god, that, that iron sight. I'm guessing that's full auto, and the first one was single. So we'll put it on single just in case. It's like spawn and oh my god, I don't like this. It's like a a a pistol, but it's not a pistol.
I'm using the fucking shoulder brace as an extra. Kill this guy. There's something off to my right. There's a uh, rift. Cannot with this dumb with this gun I cannot aim the life of me. Oh fucking jump scare. I think if I treat it like a pistol, I'll aim a little bit better. Kind of. Come up the stairs. I'm like holding my controllers so close together because of the, uh, because of how small the gun is. Six 
Oh, fuck. God, I think I made this game, like, twice as difficult than it used to be. Honestly, it's just twice as worse for me now. There we go. Found what I was coming here for. Ooh. Another... 9 by 18. Nice. Come on, don't be a demon drawer. Just open as you're intended to. I think I flipped the tide before accepting these missions. So all these houses should be, should have new loot in them. Worth grabbing. If I can find anything. Stop grabbing the big thing. Uh, nine by... 
by 19, yeah, 9 by 19. More 9 by 19. Slug ammo. 762 by 25, sweet. Making me crunch. All right. There's a samples container over there. Yeah. Crap. Maybe I might bring back that mod. Well, I feel like time is not an issue really in this game. Why are you up there? Why have I never noticed that thing up there? Huh. I've never noticed that thing up there. Can I touch it? Alright, breaking the game just so I can go touch something. No, oh, you're grabbable. Of course you are. Strange teddy bear. Holding it in my hands, I hear someone's forgotten thoughts. Here you are, my faithful friend for eight years. Don't be sad. Let's fix your paw. It won't hurt, I promise. Collectible. Collectibles in the game. Every game has collectibles. But can you find all the collectibles? That's the question. Is there anything down here? Worth looting? Not really. There's my, there it is. Isn't this where the samples are? No, it's probably over one. It's over here. upstairs might be upstairs I rarely ever check upstairs because I forget that some of these collapsed buildings have an upstairs yep there it is Ooh, and another syringe some candy and there we go got the container All right, uh, what's next? M3, M1 is a elimination cleanup. M3 is a neon. Did we complete all of, all of the uh, fixing elite? Yeah, secondary objective clear, good. Um, did we search this house? I don't think we did. No, we did. Yeah, everything's open. Okay. Uh, is a house back here that we didn't search. And the barn. Barn and my dead body there. Fucking spawn. There's so many spawn now. I don't like it. Oh, hey, look. Ammo box. Hoggers. 76254AR. And then there's also another PU scope. Basically seeing a PU scope is basically telling me, hey, I should, uh, I should definitely get the Mosin Nagant. I saw a, uh, YouTube short about how to shoot the Mosin Nagant in 60 seconds, and he called it the, the shit rifle, because he hate because I guess he hates the Mosin Nagant, because it technically doesn't have a, a safety on it. 
for a bolt action rifle. Around? Nope, not really. The Mosin's not a terrible rifle, in my opinion. It's just misunderstood. Oh, hey! What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Armor? Give me that shit. Sheesh, I found some armor. And I'm only, I haven't even gotten to like do the mission that's in Pavetta. The, uh, or like the story based mission that's in Pavetta factory. God damn, this, this salvaging is actually working out in my favor. Very well. Right, I can safely drop down here. Question is, should have we dropped down here? Not really, there's nothing down here to loot. So we gotta quickly head up. Hopefully it's not a mimic. other buildings over here that I could loot while I'm I'm not I'm probably not gonna go get that neon while I'm here oh hey lost logs Daichi 1.1 I'm starting to get my bearings around the two general places I end up walking into one is on the road to the supply depot and one is around a small river that goes up through I think it's a pathway according to the map it goes to this place with a street light and four black figures just standing there. Goes to this place with a street light and four black figures just standing there. Huh. I don't know what that means. How many are in here? Six. Be the last one. Yep. I need you. So we can uh, check out down here if there's anything worth looting. I need to start like uploading the uh, highlight videos to YouTube because that's what I plan to do. So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do that after today's stream. I'll do that after I stream. Give. Flashlight. Thank you. Oh. I I think I I think I've already got a lot of my stuff already uploaded. Um over onto uh onto YouTube. I don't know, I'm still contemplating if I want to start, like, uploading my Fractured Thrones videos to YouTube. I started, like, I started already, like, taking, like, clips from Twitch and uploading those to, like, YouTube Shorts and... And...
fuck? I can't shoot through that gap? That's annoying. I was dumb that I couldn't shoot through that tiny gap. Should have been able to. Uh, I started taking, like, my Twitch clips and already, like, turning them into, like, YouTube shorts and putting them on TikTok and such. And I kind of, like, deleted a bunch of my old TikTok videos that I had because I was, like... So if you ever, like, scroll on TikTok and you see, like, a lot of people who make uh, TikToks on, like... Oh, look at this impossible TikTok game that no one can beat and everyone just fails it and I just I just look at them for a good like five seconds and it's like oh here's the solution and then I'll sometimes and then I made like TikToks where I just like all right here's the solution this is how you do it and those get so most of them got like 200 views and I'm like okay that's that's okay that's standard but I feel like it wasn't what I should have been creating for content. I don't like trying- I'm trying- I've basically been insulting everybody who's been getting, like, views based on their failures. And I'm like, all right, if you want to do that and join the crowd and be a failure like everyone else, go ahead. But that's- that's- there's not- that's not a direction that you should be going in life. Honestly, because we're all being told to like, you need to be successful in life, not, not a failure. So when I see a lot of people who are actively, actively failing, it's kind of stupid. Ugh. I got the hiccups. It, it's really dumb that you have these people who like, will not, will pretend to be stupid or stupid, or pretend to be Stup as stupid as they actually are in real life and I, I hate it so much so I just kind of like I went through my entire channel on TikTok and ended up deleting all the videos even I had one that was like nearing a thousand views of me doing the correct answer for the game and I'm like if people just people just want to fail at life good for them I don't care. I'm just gonna... I just deleted all my videos. Don't care anymore. I'm going to... I'm gonna focus on, like, either posting my Twitch clips as to TikTok and YouTube and then try to figure out how else I'm gonna, like, make content on those platforms. But, yeah. Oop. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, let's take care of stuff because we're not going to be bringing this anymore. We're not bringing you. We're going to go ahead and put you back where you belong. Why am I crouched? There we go. Alright. Collectible. Let's put you up here on the top shelf. Like, good little bear. All right, there's my cell pile, as well as a can of pineapples. We'll go ahead and eat a few bites of. And another can of pineapple.
So do I already have a box of this? Yeah, I already do have a box of it. Nice. So, since I already have a box and I don't think I'm going to be using this too much, I'm going to go ahead and sell it. Because, well, I might as well just keep it just in case. Because having a box might be helpful. Like, like the same way as like how I keep a small box. This is 9x19. And it's a Glock magazine. But I already have five Glock magazines. But I can use it to replace this one. Because this one is in shitty condition. This is 762 by probably the green box. Right? Probably this box. Yeah. AKM short. Yep. <sighs> also a good condition magazine. We'll go ahead and swap it out. Slug ammo, large can of beef. <clears throat> New box of buckshot. U scope. Uh, I already found this one, so I'm gonna put it over. I'm gonna put it in here. Since I already found it. Cassettes. Oh, Bunk. Bunk. There we go. All cleaned up. Taken care of. That's in good condition. Oh, you need to be. Oh, you also. Okay. So we'll go over and take care of those after we take a listen to these. Never mind. UNPSC, Explorer 12. Log 10-12, Stomper Anomaly. The Stomper is controversial. Explorers and researchers have reported hearing but not seeing a giant invisible creature lurking around the radius, identified only by the sounds of heavy rhythmic stepping. An explorer I know claims that he was killed by the Stomper once, and that it was one of his most confusing deaths. He heard something nearby that sounded kind of like thunder, but couldn't see anything unusual. Being a brave fool, he decided to locate the source of the sound and move towards it. And then, bam, it was like a tsunami came down on him out of nowhere. He only had time to think, a fly beneath the fly swatter, and then he was dead. To be clear, there are no documented cases of its effects. Reports have That's an achievement, I think. Crush anything with 100 tons of weight. Other theories include... 
Yeah, I think the I think the stomper anomaly is a uh, achievement. Let's grab you, you. We'll go ahead, and grab all this stuff as well. <clears throat> Getting, getting killed by a stomper anomaly, I think, is an achievement. But I'll, I'll probably look that one up. That's like the, uh, and there's also, there's another achievement. It's the Iron Man achievement, but it doesn't matter what difficulty you play it on, thankfully. So I could literally tackle that on easy if I wanted to. Which I might, and I probably do that on my off time. To see if I could speed run that. I'm not really. F it's just achievement. It's just an achievement to just try and aim for, so it's nothing major. Samples. Sheesh, not a big reward. Yay, security level two. Oh, proceed to the shooting range. More. More. Hey, you gotta do this before you can continue on. Survival training. Whoa. Entity and anomalous activity is more severe the closer you get to the center. To have a chance at surviving, complete the tasks from your mission computer to gain access to top priority missions that unlock your access level. Choose it. Bitch, I'm just behind the fucking thing. SKS.
FMJ standard cartridge of this caliber of characteristic and change. AP armor penetration, but with reduced damage, most effective against special armor and subsonic. Decreased volume of fire, but reduced damage and bullet range. Special pistol cartridge with increased damage and armor penetration plus P. Plus P is the good stuff. Got it. That's what I'm hearing. I want to like do the HK slap with this, but I can't. Well, let me. I wish this was faster. I wish loading a gun would be faster. God, this thing already got, like, yellowed by shooting it so much. Grab the weapon with both hands as it gets forced into the gun. Ah, uh, focusing mode, yes. There's actually a focus mode in this.
aware of the tide. This phenomenon resets things inside the radius and yep. happens at fixed intervals. Yep. Check your tide meter and plan accordingly. I don't even get to look at it. Damn it. Whatever. Ugh. Ugh. Hi. Totally what I meant to grab. That was... Fifty. Putting on attachments. How to put on attachments. How to attach a muffler and crap. Go to the pile. Any other free stuff out here? Or are you just gonna tell me a tip on... Grenades! I love grenades. Oh my god, grenades. Look, 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 look. You just... You, you just... Hold the pin. And you throw. Grenades are actually pretty decent. It's easier to throw underhanded than it is to throw overhanded. That's the name of the game when playing in VR. Just throw underhanded. The fuck is that? What are you? Are you like a headlight? Or a streetlight? Are you part of that streetlight? I don't know. I'm still waiting for the next game to come out. Hopefully, sometime this year. Missions, top priority, flash in the dark. Unknown artifact. Samples in Balotki. Heavy helix, I already got one. Can I just deliver this? I just go over here and just like, hey, I have a heavy helix already. Oh my god, yeah, I can. Sweet. Boom. Yeah. Uh, repair. Bonk. And uh, get in there. Yeah. Get in there. <sighs> Are you fucking kidding me? 10 k- oh my god, repair is gonna be expensive as fuck. Um, let's- let's repair that. Jeez. Fucking stealing all my money. Did I have that- is that set in the difficulty thing? It might be. Great, um... Well that sucks. I mean, I could look if it's set in difficulty. Uh, settings, difficulty, weapon, anomaly damage, yeah. Mission money reward decreased. Enemy count increased. Yeah, I increased the enemy count, which is probably a bad idea, but I might set that back down to normal just in case. Item sell. No, there's not there's not one for repair. I think it's just it was just expensive just because of the item. What why are you blinking at me? Why are you blinking at me? Yeah? Yeah? Are you okay? You're on my head. You should be fine. Don't be blinking at me. All right, let us grab ammo. Reload these pistol mags. What? I thought I had a fourth mag. Did I not have a fourth mag? Oh, it's probably because it's already in the gun. Yeah. Alright. Grab that. Pistol mag. Uh, still not going to the next area.
spawn and a fragment. That's, I don't like doing paparazzi. So let's go straight to Blotki. Yep. I don't think I have anything else loot-wise in, per in Pervame. So we'll just go to Blotki and hope for the best. Not all anomalies will react to thrown probes. Always be cautious. Yeah, like this one. You don't know what happens when you throw it into the web. Nothing happens, actually. It was like, oh, it must be safe. No, fuck it ain't. No, the fuck it ain't. I'm not going to spend a lot of time right now because it is dark outside. So I think we will go over to the safety, the safe house, and we'll sleep there for the night. And then we'll, we'll go to that safe house right there. Uh, we'll sleep for the night. And then in the morning, we will tackle this place. It is currently 610. It is a bit late right now, and I do not like it when it is this late outside. So we're gonna we're gonna edge around the web. And we're gonna sleep. And in the morning, we can tackle this place. When it's not freaking nighttime. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. What do you know? Buckshot. AP of 9x19. And a 357 Magnum. I hear you. Morning, minus one, sleep. Probably a bit hungry as well after that. All right. So M3 is flash in the dark. We need to find the unknown artifact. We'll need a gas mask, obviously. In and out is a neon, which is there. And then samples are up by Operation Cleanup, which we're gonna ignore for now. So we're gonna go over here and take care of that artifact. Since I pretty well know the uh, whole gist and layout of this mess. It shouldn't be too difficult. And there should be, yep, our little, one of our story guys is here, in black. Ah, the brighter future that never got built. Faith brushes, faith bureaucracy. Hey, what's that glow on the second floor? Glow on the second floor, yep. We're good to about here. This guy, thankfully, we're tall enough that it doesn't hurt us or activate on us, so. It's like right over there, maybe? So we'll take a left. Is there one over there? There might be, actually. Yeah. 
That's not what we want. But it's a free artifact. So it's over there in the middle. So we will go around this way, I think. Yeah. Is there a... There you are, unknown artifact. And then I think just have to just walk all the way around unless there's anything else here there is something else it's over there all right we'll go grab that while we're here I remember last time I went over there it was this way it was safe do that again. heard him underneath me. <sighs> so, we got a, a helix. And a stellation. A stellaron! We got a stellaron! <laughs> Alright. And then we go over to M2, which is a neon... And then we will head back to base. What are we doing on time? We're at one day left. Oh, we could probably do a flip on the radius pretty soon. Probably. Be helpful. I thought I heard a footstep, but I guess I didn't. Go over this way. Nine by 18. And a 9 by 19 round. It's actually over there. Um. Anything over here worth noting? Not really. Just really big. Sneak right between those two. Oh, hi there. Never mind. Why am I going this way? This is a dead end. It's literally pushing me to go that way, which I don't want to go that way. Just go back. <laughs> you want to go this way? Well, too fucking bad. You don't get to go that way. Uh, fuck, and I can't cut across the web. I was like, could I cut across there? And then I see a tiny little strand. Um, alright, fuck. I guess I have to go this way. I guess I will cut across around this way. I see you up there. Don't you don't see me. You do see me. Fuck you. <laughs> We're gonna go this way. We're gonna
fucking hell. Ow. Pinned. Oh my god. Why? 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 Jin, I'm gonna wait for him to jump. In my face. Fuck. Why? 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 Stop running. I dare you to. Oh, God. Fuck. Oh, no. my pistol. <gasps> Jesus! Fucking stop! Coming at me! <gasps> Are we good? Are we done? <gasps> Maybe that neon isn't worth it. <gasps> Jesus. Oh. God. Fucking shit. Fucking fuck all of you. Oh. Let me reload my shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, not more. Gosh. Thought I just saw a shotgun shell on the floor. Did I not? No, that's probably a dead one. God damn. More? having to go this way, but I have to get to... I have to head back! Okay, he's way in the distance. God damn it, I hear more. I hear a rift. I'm gonna ignore that rift. I'm gonna run this way. Jeez.
course there's a rift. Of course there's a rift when I don't have a, a an assault rifle to really deal with these enemies. <gasps> Alright, let's leave. Is Skyrim up here, or is it too steep? I think it's too steep. Oh, maybe not. Good. Ah, damn, I almost died there. Again. And that time would have been not my fault, because la <laughs> when I died last time, I shot a explosive barrel that was too close, apparently. It should have killed the spawn, honestly. That explosion was close enough. For the if the spawn was that close and I was that close, yeah, the spot, the spawn should have also been killed. Looking back on it. Alright, the neon is not worth it. We're just gonna go back. <sighs> Playing without the shop sucks so much. Oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. I feel like I'm I feel like there's several moments I should have died, but I'm still alive. Was that oh, flash in the dark things keep getting stranger a neighbor told me about some toxic fog at the swamp he noticed a weird glow in the abandoned building and wanted to check it out but ran into an armed man inside and then everything got covered in thick green smoke he started choking and fled he kept telling this to people over and over but it sounds too crazy too crazy 19-1 armor. Make sure to protect yourself. Gas mask will lower damage taken from the anomalies and protect you from toxic pollution. Helmet will reduce damage taken from bullets, claws, and explosions. Fix them when needed. I fucking did. But my helmet is about to fucking break. <sighs> oh yeah, another. Oh, crap. I'll take that back. I repair my helmet? Yeah, sweet. God. I probably... Probably shouldn't have made it so that selling items. Nah, I, th I think this is nah. I think it's fair and balanced that all my sold items, every item I sell, is actually worth worse, uh, worth less than you would think. It just gives a challenge, really, to uh, how. How I have to explore and shit. It is quite the challenge, actually. Very annoying. I have so many. S
should sell all those boxes pretty soon. And probably sell that as well. One of the scopes. Since I already have one, I don't need two. Not what I was trying to do. Not what I'm trying to do! Game? Jeez. Oh, jeez Louise. So many boxes of ammo. Nope. You are seven six two fifty four AR, but it's not a surplus round. It's just a normal cartridge. And you're the uh and this is the AP variant. Yeah. <sighs> Fucking hell. Probably sleep again until the next tide. <sighs> so we can, because when I'm consuming this many small ammo boxes in such a short time, it's it's going to start to hurt in the end. Oh, jeez. 162. Just a bunch of empty ammo boxes that I don't really need to keep. So, small amount of money. Don't care. <sighs> Complete the following. One mission. Do I have a mission I need to turn in? Or no? Oh, I do have a mission I can clean it. Oh! That's what- That's why I got overrun by a bunch of fucking enemies. It's because I had a- It's because of the- The, uh, cleanup mission. Jeez. Fuck those guys. They all just ran over as soon as they heard shooting. Ugh. Lost tape recorder. That's in. That's in the... That's in the factory. <laughs> and another operation cleanup. <sighs> Give me stuff in Pervame, please. Which I really need. <sighs> One day, six hours. It's currently... Just sleep, and then we'll grab food. Oh, I didn't need that last pineapple slice. 14 hours. So 14 hours from now, zero. Let me click. Fourteen, actually fifteen hours. So we'll sleep till fifteen. Yep. Tide flip. Do one more just in case. We'll finish off the can just in case. Would be a better answer. Alright. New tide. New loot. We're going to start in Pervame. 
radius treasure. God damn it. We're gonna start in... No more missions can be accepted. I have five missions already? Damn. Alright, we're gonna start in Pervame route. The first area. Our primary goal is looting. Is trying to find lots of ammo, lots of stuff. As much as we can. It's literally, I have to spend a lot of tides in. I have to spend a lot of tide refreshes. Just trying to get stuff and using this box as well at the beginning of every tide. Every time the tide flips, I come up here, grab some free stuff. the story. If you're in this place, you shouldn't be here. Nice. Nice. Oh my god, nice? Starting off strong already? Jeez, I love it. Good amount of starting loot items in the first... Oh my god! More? Bam! 762. Good. Pistol ammo. Oh my god. A lighter. Don't care. AP for 9x18. Oh, fucking. Fucking finally getting some good stuff. I saw an enemy right there. Oh my god! More, some SP-40, good. No need to waste ammo when we're trying to get ammo. Let's look up here. Yep, another one. Good. Nothing in here. Ooh. Nope. This fucking lighter still. Can I just destroy the condition of this? If I just keep it lit? Oh my god. Torchlight? Who would have thought? I don't think this is destroying the condition much. I wish I had a headlamp instead of this chest lamp. Alright. Let's go. Let's go over this way. of anomalies have switched places to different areas. Fucking dare you to jump at me.
wish stashes would also reset. That would be cool if stashes did a reset as well. Did my knife break? Oh, my knife probably broke. Oh no. Oh fuck. It's upstairs. My knife broke, I think. God damn. Well. paying attention my knife broke i didn't think i was using it that much unless the knife loses durability when you do when you eat food as well that would be interesting to learn steps over there oh hey hello or nine by 18 ammo that's good I need that Rift. Rift is priority. As much as we can. Gonna spawn. Ow, my face. Oh shit, you jumped. I wonder if shooting that next to the rift, does that count for the achievement? Does killing, does destroying a rift with a explosion give me that achievement? I bet it won't, but it'd be funny if it did. Oh, hey! That's a GSH-18, nice. And some, some ammo that we can... Nice, more ammo. And another PP-91 short.
I wish I had a flashlight that I could put on my gun. Like a pistol flashlight. Be very helpful right about now. I'm getting a lot of 9x18 ammo, which is super helpful. We can, we can head back into that other, other area. This flashlight is still fucking here. It's funny. It's still, uh, it's still, uh, keeping the black grass at bay. Which, that is a smart thing. Good, good recommend recommendation to anyone playing this game. If you leave a flashlight just anywhere, it will stay there. And I think it's like items that the player picks up. If you pick up an item and then drop it back down, it's going to stay in the radius permanently. Because every time I come back here, and this is like maybe the third or fourth radius, like or tide flip, and that flashlight is still there. It is a good recommendation to just leave a flashlight somewhere where you can come back, where you will probably be coming back to loot, and you know there's black grass that you need to deal with. Now, if that's the case, if, if, my, if my theory is correct and everything stays, then if I find any, like, cigarettes or packs of packs of cigarettes or lighters it might be be a good idea to just like sell those like right here would be a great spot for a flashlight to just drop right there and while I'm gonna I still have my my uh, flashlight mounted on my lapel. I love spooky noises in the back of my ear. Hey, cassette tape. 762. And a cigarette. I don't know if cigarettes go back into packs. Let's find out. Do you have any space? Yes, you do. Sweet. Anytime I find a cigarette, I can just plop it in a, plop it in that. I'm going to start grabbing cigarette packs so I can sell them. So I don't have to carry them around or have to see them spawn anymore. Lots of shotgun ammo, which is good. I think this is the first when I first came to this place I found a uh, the gas mask. But now I found a helmet.
always come down to take a look down here just in case there's something that spawns. Shouldn't have rolled up my sleeves because it's a pain to get them back rolled back down. So I'm gonna go back to that place. Cause I know that there were some cigarettes and cigarette lighters that I left behind. So I can just go ahead and grab those to sell them. So I didn't fully explore, I think. I don't think I checked out the top. Wait, is there a, uh... No, okay. But there was a cigarette in there. On that shelf. The demon drawer fixed? Demon drawer fixed itself. Nice. Ooh. Right, demon drawer is this one, which is fine. Or was it this one? No, it was this one. <laughs> Bottom, middle. Of course it is. Is there anything in there anyway? Oh, there is. There is this time. Nice. I would say, I hope in the second game that they fix uh, how sensitive Uh, grabbing like drawers is because I feel like it's too sensitive in a way. Wait, can I not? There we go. I have to be holding a pack of cigarettes. I'll just put that there for now since I don't have a knife. I don't have a knife. What do I have? A pack of cigarettes. <laughs> I'm gonna fight you with a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> First one to die of lung cancer <laughs> loses. <laughs> I shouldn't really joke about that, but that's basically the idea. Yeah, it's so you have to have like your hand in a certain position for it to like open up. So it's so freaking finicky on opening drawers that way. to get finished up here soon because it's almost night time. Oh. Yeah, we're good on storage. Hydrate. All right. Oh, I still have a water bottle on my desk. I think I need to do a mandatory stretch. My back is hurting. I will say the one problem with being a VR streamer is standing up. Oh, fuck. Ow. Oh, oh yeah. There we go. That's better. 
Yeah, it hurts to stand up. Also, I have like a, I don't even know how heavy the index is, but I have this weight on my face, which is not comfortable at all in the slightest. So I think that's also a, a, a huge factor in like comfort. Uh, we will go over to that train and we'll sleep there till the morning time and then we can keep looting. I think we can, we got plenty of storage space for more loot so we can just, we got plenty of ammo so we'll just quickly Spend the time to restock. Huh. Didn't spawn me another thing there. It's been spawning me the couple last couple tides. It'll spawn me a regen that's on very low condition right there. This time it didn't. Oh, gosh! I'm finding a lot of cassette tapes. Good, because that's an achievement to find all the cassette tapes that tell the uh, story. Of the tide. Hello. Eod Slim. Interesting name. Hello, give me give give me what I want. Not that. This. Well, I can't eat you, so. Cause I don't have a knife. Why did I open you? <laughs> I don't have a knife right now, because my knife apparently broke. Um, so yeah, I definitely, I probably should just head back. Uh, I mean, we're good on ammo for the most part. Whoa. So, honestly, honestly, I could just go to the train yard. Hopefully we'll find a knife while we're at the train yard. That's, that's what I'm hoping to happen. More shotgun shell. And another bag of probes. Well, one's up on that, uh, on that, uh, tanker. One's over my left. Like, distant left or not not close left, I hope. Didn't sound like he was close left. Spotted. Oh, he was just, he was like kind of close left. He's stuck. I put him out of his misery. What are the weapons you main? Uh, this is my second playthrough, but uh, anything that's bullpup, I'm a, I'm a bitch when it comes for using bullpup weapons. I love them. So, the AUG. I don't like the Groza because of the iron sights. I don't know. I don't remember if I could upgrade it so that I could replace it with normal sights. But definitely the Stair AUG is one of my favorites. There's a rift. 
We need to destroy that rift. We should focus on destroying the rift. God, my aim sucks. No, Max is dead. Max is dead? But is dead Max gonna come out to play? <laughs> oh my god, one of these boys. I already have. Oh. Plus, minus 30% recoil. Oops, not what I wanted. Also, minus 30% recoil. Well, we're gonna leave you behind for now. We'll come back and grab you probably when we're heading out. Uh, I do like the, um, the FN-17 Scar. It's definitely one of my favorite, like, like, assault rifle types. Um, I don't have a lot of favorite, I don't have a lot of favorite guns. Anything, like, anything German is probably a favorite. God, my aim. I couldn't fucking line up my target with my iron sights. Really? My aim is, like, kind of rough, I know, when it comes to using iron sights. Uh, let's see here. Let's go this way, because there's a guy there. We should probably end his life. I dropped my scar one time. I only realized because of the laser I had attached. Ah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, why the fuck is there a laser just shining over there? Yeah. Yeah. This is a. Yeah, this is my second playthrough of the game, and I'm currently playing with a couple of mods. Uh, the primary. The primary mod of this entire playthrough is the scavenger mod which completely disables the shop so I can't buy anything I have to find it um, I've actually been already pretty lucky to already have found a helmet uh, armor and a gas mask actually I have I have two helmets now and like I have a gas mask waiting back at base So, god damn these goddamn drawers. I hate the drawers. I'm so fucking finicky. Re. Re. So, I always have to keep on, like, resetting the tide. Like, my tide only lasts three days. But even then, I feel like I need it to be a bit shorter. So I'm not running out of ammo. So fast. I say running out of ammo, and I was like, but why not I just use melee? Melee sucks in VR. Trying to use melee weapons at all in any game sucks. Because when you're trying to do something, and then the enemy also in melee combat can hit you from a longer distance. Why did you pop out? And you can hit them is really annoying. Also, this is confusing. Why is it red when it's supposed it's supposed to be red, but now it's but it's actually green. It's a weird there's a weird bug in the game for that. Alright. Uh I'm a little good at fighting with the Spetsnaz knife. <laughs> I had a Spetsnaz knife, and then it suddenly broke on me without me paying attention, so that's why I have a pack of cigarettes here. <laughs> I was just like, okay, my, my knife broke. 
I guess I wasn't paying attention. I forgot to uh, check its durability. And it was a Spetsnaz knife. But it is now no more. So I'll just go back and get one of my other backup knives that I have. I don't have a backup Spetsnaz. Oink. Uh, bah, bah. More shotgun shells, Jesus. So much buckshot. Even though I don't have a really good buckshot gun to be using to, uh, to, uh, like, <sighs> oh, hello. Assault rifle. That's not an assault rifle. Hey, that's a PP-91 long mag. And a GSH-18. Nice. That's good. More cassette tapes! Jesus! Ah. Oh. Ba-ba-ba. Ba-ba-ba. Da-da-da-da-da. Alright. Spetsnaz knives are so rare from what I've seen. Yeah. Uh, but the great thing about the mod, the scavenger mod, it makes rare items, like, actually appear more often. Like, the helmet, the body armor, they actually appear. Because I found this body armor when I was over in, uh, Balotki. And... So, it- so it's a good- good idea to, like, have this mod. Since I'm just playing a- a no-shop run. So I'm always having to, like, stockpile on ammo and everything I find. Right now, that's basically all I can do is, like, stock up on... on whatever I find. When you can't use the shop and you go outside and you take a deep breath and you get real high... Ah! Uh, I scream at top of my lungs, what's going on? And I said, hey, 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 I said, hey, oh, what's going on? It's an empty bag I threw away probably last time I was here, so I'll go ahead and like bring it back to sell. God, so many bucks! So much friggin' buckshot! God! I have so much buckshot ammo, it's unreal. I'm literally gonna. If I had so much buckshot ammo, why aren't they giving me like a street sweeper? <laughs> Let me just have a street sweeper and just like go to town on people. Hey, another ramrod. That's good to, like, have a backup of. What's going on? And I said, hey, yeah, 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 hey, yeah. I said, hey, what's going on? God, football, football season, this suck, uh, this season is terrible. I don't know why my brain just decided I'm gonna talk about football and stupid shit the fucking season has turned into. <sighs> oh, it's terrible. Probably just to get my mind off of the f all this looting I'm doing. Mass loot. I know I'm gonna, as soon as I get back. Clap, let's go Buffalo, let's go clap. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, Buffalo Buffalo has had very very good games so far. I even like uh god. I don't even want it. Freaking there's the uh so many games have like gone to shit so far. Like for the uh, Eagles. I thought the Eagles were going to win the game, but no, the fucking Buccaneers. The Buccaneers are freaking 9 and 8 for their entire season and then they suddenly go 10 and 8 at, by beating the Eagles. Ugh. Let's see, so Friday and Saturday we have district games, I think. And then on Sunday is a Pro Bowl? Or am I off? I think Sunday is still like district championship games. And then... And then on... Oh shit, I really need to eat. I use the Saiga and I like how the ammo is so common. Yeah. I mean, if I had a lot of... I mean, I got a Saiga in my last playthrough. But the problem is... Short magazines is like the only thing you could get in the store and you'd have to like find uh long mags which was annoying so i was always like i had lots of ammo but i didn't have good enough magazines to like hold all that ammo so if you had the saiga so if you had a saiga and you had a lot of long mags yeah, you could. I know there's like a stash. I remember looking on the wiki that there's a stash you could find that has... Really? You're right there? There's a stash you can find that probably has like Psycho Long Mags. Which I will definitely have to try and find those. For sure. Which means lots of looting. Lots of exploring. Just overall, not gonna have a good time. Because the enemies are a pain to deal with. <sighs> Alright, I think we've gone all over Pervame route. For the most part. Um... Didn't really... Found a lot of ammo, found a lot of loot. Sell that. Alright, let's get a cell pile going. Bonk. Bonk, bonk. 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 Oh my god. Sell. Sell. Keep you. Sell that. Sell. Gosh. Keep good to always have an extra. Freaking hell. And I said, squee, 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 squee. Squee, squee. This is a long mag. I'm going to keep you. 
Yeah, I'm gonna keep that. <laughs> A watch got way in the one all set square, 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 square. Hey. Oot. I feel like there's a faster way to get all that ammo. Well, that's a box of slugs. If I had an empty box of, uh... Just took a box from like the bottom of a stack. Somehow. Get in there. No, not that. Not that one. This one. Yeah. <laughs> Oop. 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 Shotgun shells. Fuck so many shotgun shells. Bunk. Bunk. I'm gonna go ahead and sell this because I just found one of these and this is cooler. Two long Sanga mags are at stash 18. Yeah, I just need to find. I just need to remember or actually look up where that stash is actually located so I don't have to bother. so much stuff here that I'm just gonna end up selling. Whew. All of this. Every bit of it. Uh. No, why are you doing that? So many boxes of... And now it's green. It goes from a red light to a green light. In the span of going back to base. Ugh, it's weird. Makes no sense. Alright. Bunk. Bunk. I can't wait till this game gets multiplayer. Well, I mean, not this game, but when the second game comes out and we'll have a four player co-op, I wonder what will happen, the story unfolding. 
Ugh. Yeah, I know. Weird way of transferring ammo between boxes. weird thing with these uh, PM magazines where it just like puts bullets in between the springs is weird. There we go. Oh, where did my hand go? Hello, hand. Can I have my hand back? Where's my hand? Where'd my hand go? Oh, uh, hello? I have my hand back? Oh, oh, okay. My hand disappeared. I don't know. What happened to my hand? Oh, this game is going to be so much fun. When it gets multiplayer. It's either... I'm either going to be... When the multiplayer comes out, I'm either going to be able... I'm either going to be playing it with my partner when it comes out. Um, probably with my partner, with somebody, with maybe a few other people as well, depending. I think these hold, how many bullets? 255, 250? What the fuck? I thought these held 280 because it's a pistol mag. It's a pistol caliber. Okay. <sighs> I wish there was a faster way to transfer ammo between boxes. When you have like this where you want to put all your ammo into like a big box instead of having it in a small box. Let's see, this is... Yeah, I know where that one is. I need a new knife. Okay. Yeah. Into the... Yeah. I just hope that it gets announced when it's coming out, because I really want to play it. I have a bunch of... I have friends that I know who play this game. And when I heard that they were releasing a second game, I was happy. I was excited. It's coming out this year, I believe. Yes, it's coming out this year, but when they actually announce the re release date, like, I know, because we have all of 2024. Is it coming out? A, is it going to come out this winter? Is it going to come out during the summer? That's, that's the general idea is what I would like to hear. Is like, what? Day, what is the actual date? Oh, 
Two thousand. Gross. Oh. oh well. Can't do much. I ain't using it to buy anything, cause I can't buy anything. I legit can't buy shit. <laughs> Alright, let's grab our stuff. Grab our oop, we'll grab our gas mask. We'll grab a syringe. A candy bar. And we'll grab a box of buckshot. And a box of FMJ. For my pistol. <sighs> UNPSC Explorer 12 Log 10 6 Distortion Anomaly. Distortion anomalies appear to produce an area of mirage like. Yep, I already know about it. UNPSC Explorer 12 Log Steps. I already know. E. All right, and now we go to Balotki Village, and stay away from that side of the map. <laughs> we'll go to the actual village, village, and explore, and loot. Actually, yeah, it's 9.24, we got plenty of time. Early access this year, they said it should come out late 2025, bleh. I mean, isn't Into the Radius still an early access game right now? I don't think it's been a f I don't think Into the Radius has gotten a full release yet. I think it's still I think it's still early access to my knowledge. Anyway, are you coming over here? I see you. I'm just keeping my eyes open. There's a rift. Of course there's a rift. Why wouldn't there be a rift? There you are. That's what I was looking for. That's what I was hearing the, uh... Oh my god, he took... One extra shot than I expected him to. Aim sucks. Oh my god. Hello. Oh, it jammed. That's what happened. But it did also run out. It was the last round. Oh my god. I didn't die on that shot. Whoop. Oh, hello. Ow, 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 ow. Fuck you. Hi. Okay, already empty. Footsteps. I got I got time. Okay. Can't see anything through that brush. repair this gun it's starting to jam on me
What's the most annoying enemy in your opinion? I think it's the spiders. Definitely the spiders. I have to agree 100%. The spawn are the most annoying enemies in this entire game. Why are you over there? Stay over on the left hand side where you belong. Okay, nothing in there. I think, I don't think I will ever see like loot spawn in where a stash location is. So that's, that's probably something to remember. <gasps> hey, a knife. What do you have? A knife. No. No. Oh yeah, I found the, I found the armor when I was over in the second floor attic of that house across the way. The armor that I'm currently wearing. Hey, a Glock 17 in really good condition with the accuracy buff. Nice. Nice. And a nice little box. Yeah, the spawn are annoying. Every other enemy is easy to deal with. Um, as long as you're, you have ammo and your gun doesn't jam, you can easily deal with a lot of different types of enemies. <gasps> Fucking another box! God, that's my third box of 54. I don't need three boxes. Three big boxes of 54 AR. God damn. This game is like, hey, use the seven, use this caliber. I don't even have a gun that uses that caliber. Maybe you should give me a gun that uses that caliber, and maybe I'll use that gun. Maybe use the caliber. Open. God damn it, demon drawers. All drawers are demons when they don't open as they are intended. Oh my gosh, this game. And you know what ammo type you should use? Uh, the ammo type I keep spamming you with. Did I not grab a box of 9x18? Guess not. Oh my god, alright. All right. Oh, give me something good. Oh no, it wasn't this addict. It was a different addict. Nothing in there. It was one of the addicts of this house, of a, of a house in Blotki that gave me the armor. Might be that house. Doo -doo 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 -doo. There's my phone ringing. Giving me a notification of something or other. More shotgun. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Spawn are so easy to kill. Only need to hold out your knife and they jump into it. Sliders. Oh, sliders. You're talking about the sliders. Oh, um, I heard spider. I saw spiders. No, I've not tried like doing that method where you just hold out your knife and they just jump onto it. That's actually might be a good idea. It's so either I shoot a spawn as soon as I see it, or wait until they jump. Because once they jump on you... Did that go in? Yeah, that did go in. All right. Once they jump, they, uh, they're they stunned for a minute. And there's a there's a note that's over in one of the uh, Pervame Root safe houses that tells you, hey, if you ever deal with those spawn, the like spider-like enemies, just wait for them to jump. And then... 
uh, then they're vulnerable. And I was like, okay, I'll do that since I'm like trying to trying to save ammo and shit. Fragment are just so easy to deal with. Four. Uh, I haven't had much trouble with the sliders. Like, I'll wait for them to do at least, like, one or two warps to get within range. And then I can easily take them out. I've not had very many issues of them, like, really getting too close to me. So, this, I can understand having troubles with the sliders, but not really. I've, I haven't had trouble with them. It's always the spawn. Them stupid spiders. Uh, where is the fucking addict that has the shit? It's probably that one, I guess. Excuse me, anything in here? Yep. Cigarettes and a lighter. Good, a box of 76254 not surplus ammo. Finally. Heard it, Pecho. I got all three plushies and a note. Uh, I ha I only found one of the plushies in my main playthrough. I don't know where the other two would show up. I don't even remember where I even got the, uh, where I even got the, uh, first plushie of Pecho. I just found it, grabbed it, and be like, oh, this is adorable. Maybe I should just save onto it. I, I assumed it's, like, a collectible, like, almost everything else that I find is. So I just grabbed it, put it away, and then I just, like, sits in my... Um, it sits in my base, but that's my, that's, that was my main, my, uh, vanilla, my unmodded vanilla playthrough of this game on easy. This playthrough I'm on, I'm currently on normal difficulty. And currently, like, just seeing what I can find. I am currently, well, and this is also a, a modded playthrough. With a mod that really, that really changes the game. This is how I expected the game to go, but when they, when there's a freaking shop where you can buy stuff, I'm just like, eh. I love, I love the scavenger mod. It actually makes this game a lot better. It feels more immersive. Having to look around and find shit is more fun than just being, than just having to just buy it. Like this! Like a fucking new vest! <laughs> See? That's what I'm talking about! It's like when you find stuff and it makes it, it makes sense because you're finding shit that dead explorers got, or dead explorers left behind. So... It makes total sense. <laughs> it's all about... Uh, what plushie you got? I, I found the black and uh, pink one. That was my first plushie. And my one and only plushie, I guess. Is the black and pink one. I've never... Didn't even know there were... I kind of figured there would be other colors, but I haven't found any of the other colors. And you're saying green is the one that everyone finds the most? Happy plushie is the one you got. I figured, yeah, I think it was the happy one is what it was called. I was just like, eh. 
I don't know. I don't know where the other ones spawn. I don't... I, I don't really spend that much time looking around. In my main game, at least. But I think I will definitely spend a lot more time. Like, for, um... For the factory, I didn't spend a lot of time up here. I never went up to this top right corner. I spent a lot of time, like, here. And then going over this way so I could get over to the Zarya, the Kolka Zarya. <clears throat> uh, but I rarely ever did spend uh, time. Um, like, here in Balotki Village, like, this village is, like, my main my main hangout spot that I would go to because it was directly from the base. It was directly from an entrance to the base. It was very easy to get to and in and out of. So that's kind of like how I stuck. All right, we might as well go do the other things. Hmm. Operation cleanup. Oh god, there's an operation. There's a cleanup operation. I don't even have an assault rifle! Ooh! Bitch, where'd you come from? Oh, you're one of those guys. Alright. Jesus. I was like, I'm just. Fuck you, seekers. Seekers are annoying. Oh. Hi, fan. I'm your biggest fan. Oh. Oh my god, it's not- this is not like the third PU scope I've found at- a f in all my playthroughs, jeez. Like, chill game. I don't need that many PU scopes. Oh my gosh. I've only gone to the school in Balotki once and it was only to climb the crane for fun. Oh yeah, because there's an achievement for climbing the crane. And I did that last time. I already found the stash here. Yeah. I I found that stash and I don't even have the note for it. Oh well. Um We're just trying to cut across this way. Right there, isn't there? Is there not one right there? Wow. I guess one didn't spawn there. One spawned there last time. I had the rough thing of like, when I came to this place and I went through that entrance, there was a distortion anomaly directly on where I spawned. So I was already getting damaged. As soon as I come out of the, uh, the fence or whatever, the flag stuff, I was like, that is such bullshit to get like, Instant spawned anomaly. Hello. Jeez. Tanky much? I've only, uh, is in the room with the white box, intrusion mission. Room with the white box. Uh, what? Intrusion mission. I don't remember. Room with the white box. It's not, not coming to mind.
Like, I had one that was, like, literally right where I put that probe. And it was annoying as fuck. I know this is a stash. I accidentally found this out that and learned it was a stash later on. I was like, wait a minute, I thought loot just spawned there naturally. Eh, I still don't want to try it. How the fuck do you get on the roof? I feel like you can get on the roof of the school because an enemy can spawn up there. Like, there's like an enemy with like an, an AK that will spawn up there or an assault rifle that will spawn there normally. And I always get concerned. It's like, there's got to be a way to get up there if an enemy can spawn up there. That's just my theory, but if that's not true, then it's fine. Oh my god, my voice went the wrong direction. Ugh. Ugh, my voice just like went <clears throat> extra nasally or something. I don't know if they got picked up on the mic. But I felt my voice like in the back of my throat for a split second. All right, let's go in with a full mag at least. Hopefully we don't jam. Need to get that rift. It should be like hopefully first floor. Off shotgun my ass. Oh my god. I should have. I had a sawed off shotgun myself. I should have just approached him with that. Quickly go back. Fuck this game sometimes. <sighs> Pretty sure it's to get level three and it's in Pabetta. Uh, I don't remember. the second time I've died. I didn't die a single time in my last playthrough. Granted, it was on easy. Granted, I could use the store. Did stuff spawn? Did stuff re- Does stuff respawn if you die? I hear a- I hear a spawn. Unless it ran all the way over here. I hope it fucking didn't. I hope enemies don't respawn or spawn once you clear out an area. That'd be so dumb. I thought enemies reset on the tide, not on... I had armor too. I had armor and it could and that enemy two shot me. <laughs> at point blank range. I mean at point blank range I could understand that, but and with a sawed off shotgun. But still, that was annoying as fuck. 
Uh, I had a backup helmet just in case, but I don't think I needed it. Because I'm just going to run back over there. Hopefully kill that enemy. Oh my god, more enemies did spawn. What the fuck? What the fuck? I just want to get my stuff back. I want to kill this guy first, because the fragment's going to be easier to deal with. But this guy's going to be more annoying. my advanced probes. Where is pistol? Did I lose the pistol? Did it steal my TT-33 pistol? Where the fuck did it do to my pistol? I don't remember grabbing it. That's annoying. Maybe it warped through the wall. Thank you. 
Come. John, come on, breakfast. Oh, hey, holographic sight. Nice. I want to find my pistol. I want to know what happened to my pistol. Oh, hi there. Fuck you. Why didn't you jump at me? Why didn't you jump at me? Oh, you glitchy ass little fucker. Why didn't you jump at me when you had the opportunity? Oh my god. Oh yeah yeah yeah. I'm getting my jump scares and I hate it. I want my pistol. Inside the pipe, under the yellow factory. Oh, I know where that one is. Where did my pistol go? Where the fuck is my... Hey, grenade. Holy shit, that grenade would have been helpful earlier. Yeah. <sighs> Where's my pistol? That I'm not- I think my pistol might be somewhere else. Might be... Down here? I'm guessing based on how my death body is... You left-handed? Yeah, I am. I am left-handed. <sighs> it's easier for me to aim that way. I'm left-handed, but I'm right-handed with the pistol. It's awkward, I know. Where did my pistol go? I'm angry now. I lost a perfectly good TT-33. <sighs> did I not pick it up? Oh my god, it's so fucking jumpy. Did I not? Nope, those are both Glocks. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh my god, where? Where would you be? Game stole my T T thirty three, and I'm angry. I'm upsetty. I get all the mags back except for one, which was in the gun.
This game is bullshit, I tell you. What did it do with the other box? Why did I put it over there? I hate this game where it like completely resets your organization after you clearly set it. Hi there, girl. Well, I lost a TT-33. Fuck. Means... I need to find a new one. Well, maybe I have a... Maybe I have one waiting back at base. Hopefully. I have about six Seekers chasing him. Oh yeah, the Seekers are annoying. I can understand trying to deal with like six... Seekers and such at the same time. Hey. Wink. <laughs> Not that I ever climbed it myself, but I imagined what it would be like. The vertigo. <laughs> there were some boys I knew who claimed to have made the climb. I almost believed them. But they kept arguing about particulars. How far out they could see and what. Now they're getting too zoomed in. Were you from around here? Was the chores of your home? you come here later? For work? For love? Maybe you only planned on being here for a year or two and then going home, wherever home was for you. Or maybe you fled the country? Fled the country and never returned? I know people like that too. Oh, I'm sorry. It's cruel of me to ask all these questions when you don't even know your name. No matter. I'll think of a name for you. Maybe Nemo or Maxim. Find me and we'll figure it out together. <clears throat> I thought you were left-handed. You aim exactly like me and I'm left-handed. <laughs> yeah, I'm left-handed. I, uh, well, not with pistols, like I said. Like I said, as my little, like, stick, I am right-handed when it comes to using a pistol, but I'm left-handed when it comes to using a rifle. I'm weird, I know. I'm, I'm satanistic. But that's only when I'm aiming. It's, it's not that way whenever I'm, whenever I, uh, like, I write with my, I write, right-handed
Oh, I lost the TT-33, Sag. Oh well. Just have to move on. That was the clear mission. I'm gonna head back and restock. And get refitted before we tackle the rest of this place. <laughs> I'm left-handed for basically everything. Eh. It's uh, the reason I'm left-handed for rifles is because my right hand is my or my right eye is my sniper eye. I see better with my right hand with my right eye than I do with my left. fan. My fan is on. I keep dinging it. Hey, box of buckshot. Nice. Is that my good armor? No, that's the other armor. The armor I'm currently wearing is my good armor. Safety is this way. I know there's at least like two artifacts that will spawn in that cluster. I'm missing a pistol, which I would love to shoot you with. Like, I don't have anything down here, but I have this. <laughs> oh, damn it, there's nothing here. More buckshot. And a slug. I was hoping for a box, but I guess not.
I might start a new run on Into the Radius. I would recommend it. I mean, I would also recommend it with doing the mod that I'm currently using. Like, I have like three mods that are currently active. And they're all very helpful. Like, I have... So, primary mod is the scavenger mod. Which... Um... Completely, you can completely disable the store, so you're not allowed to buy anything. You can customize how how many items will like show up, like what's your like frequency of items and how plentiful you the, you'll be. So it's really it's really a strong recommendation for me for me to tell anybody, hey, try out the. Uh, Try out the uh, scavenger mod if you play into the radius, because it will it will change your entire experience for the game. That box is almost full. Yay! And then I might end up start using it. So I highly recommend people to start if you have the game. Start playing it. Uh, the other mod I have is this, which is changes the gas mask, so it's um, it's clear. It's not um, painful to stare through for like as a streamer and people and people watching like content. So it's definitely that's definitely a strong recommendation of mine. I don't want to sell that. I want to put it away over here. Uh, the other mod I have is a uh, carry weight. Yeah, my carry weight is actually, it's a lot easier to work with. With having, uh, I think it's like only a 50% increase. So it works pretty well in tandem with the scavenger mod by making it so that you can carry more uh, because that's mainly what you're going to be doing with the scavenger mod is doing lots of looting. <clears throat> so. Yeah. Uh, I only have like these three mods and that's it. Oh, that's a different... That's not... That doesn't belong there. That belongs over here. Have a TT thirty three. No, I do not. Fuck. I have a PM. I have a Glock, and I have a GSH. So I guess I can put away these these bullets, and I'll just save the magazines. That sucks. I lost my TT-33 somehow. I don't like it. Game, game, game stole my gun from me. Oh my god, I hate when I... Well, I have to do an IRL crouch just to grab something that flew off the shelf. real a uh, long lost twin use the same shelves for the same stuff I do <laughs> I mean I mean we might be we might be twins I don't know <laughs> I don't know do you live in Texas <laughs> if you're about to say you fucking live in Texas I'm gonna be so fucking surprised
Hey, I just got I just got a bunch of these. Nice. Wait, what? Oh, you're a surplus round. I didn't know about that. I didn't know. Sadly, no. Okay, not twins. <laughs> it's all right. Yeah, I wouldn't want to live in Texas either, especially with how cold it's been getting lately. It's so freezing. It's freezing cold, and I don't like it. Ugh, let me start a new stack of 9x19 back here. If it'll just freeze in place, please. I can plop you there. Kind of wait for it. Like, out. <gasps> High closet. I didn't realize I was close to you. <sighs> Hello. Good attachment. You're full. Nice. And develop another one. That's. A, I need a slug box. I think I have an extra slug box. Look, Sean. I might have a slug box in here. Yeah, all the way down there. Wait, fuck. Give me that back. There. Holy shit, I have so much freaking candy. Somebody stop me. I have so much candy, but I don't have a white van. <sighs> Keep that extra knife. That's nine by nineteen, but not. There we go. That's that is seven six two twenty five. Yay! And that's a mag worth keeping. Boom. <sighs> Ugh, all right. You probably better in damage. And you have a top rail. No, you have a side rail. I think I'm going to keep that because it's been more trustworthy. Well, I need a new pistol. So the question is, what pistol am I going to switch to? Um, I think the Glock... Doesn't the GSH... 
9 by 18. Well, I have a big box of 9 by 18. I might as well. But let's go do... Let's go sell shit first. Before we, uh... Because all this shit needs to be sold. Try to get a lot of money for it. When we're not gonna get a lot of money for it. Well, we, we destroyed a couple of rifts, so the rifts will help a lot. Oh, hello. Go ahead and sell all of these as well. locker is kind of different, but the knives and ammo are about the same. I built an entire desk out of knives inside the shop. Also plan to build a fort out of grenades and smoke grenades. <laughs> nice. each their own. I wish there was a faster way to sell. Like, I wish I could just, like, everything that's in my backpack, sell all. Like, if I just did that, and it would just grab it from my backpack and sell it. Thousand. Ugh. Ooh, it sucks. Ugh. <sighs> the amount of money I get for selling items is decreased, and the amount of money I get for mission rewards is decreased. It's pain. My life is pain. Explorers. It has come to the attention of the United Nations Pechorsk Special Committee that many rumors are circulating as to the origins of the UNPSC, as well as the agency's legitimacy and Where is the speaker? This memo is intended to clarify the it's purpose like over of the there UNPSC somewhere. and put to rest any doubts about the legality of its activities and the good faith in which they are conducted. When the Pechorsk Exclusion Zone was established, in the aftermath of it's the like right here, known as the event, right here, there was great controversy surrounding the political status of yeah. the exclusion zone. Literally put it right here. The Russian government, which had been first to send in its military and rescue weird workers, spot for the speaker, that Pechorsk had become its sole responsibility. Meanwhile, NATO, which had also <sighs> sent in troops soon after the event, oh. argued for the global significance of the exclusion zone and demanded to oversee security and research activities in the region. A treaty was eventually brokered through the UN, creating the United Nations Pechorsk Special Committee, or UNPSC, to ensure that the security of the Pechorsk Exclusion Zone would be maintained and research carried out in the spirit of international cooperation. Any claims of exploitation of explorers by the UNPSC are patently false. Those explorers who remember a rich and prosperous world before the event may try to convince you otherwise. But they have not seen the global economic, political, and environmental changes that have occurred. The world outside has become harsher than it once was, both within and outside the radius. Thus, from the very beginning, it has been the UNPSC's mission to maintain justice and peace in and around the Pechorsk Exclusion Zone. This extends oh, to the UNPSC's contracts show. with explorers within the zone. 
That's whose cool. heroic efforts are invaluable to the research side of the UNPSC's mission. The UNPSC remains, as always, grateful for your excellent work in support of its research. I need to do that. Take damage from Stomper. Uh, that's not too difficult. I just need to find it. Find one. Uh, got 0.6 people have completed the game in Iron Man mode? What? That shouldn't be too difficult. You can literally... You can literally play the game on easy while, and set Iron Man mode up that way. You don't need... Wow. I'm confused. Alright, I guess I'm going to be using the GSH-18. Because it's... Because the game freaking stole my... My... <laughs> TT-33. I wish it reloaded magazines faster. See, 18 times, 18 times 5, 50, plus 40, 90, I have 91 rounds on me. So, yeah. Woot. Uh, Operation Cleanup. Another one. Oh boy. Sure completely opposite side of the map that's perfectly fine i'm probably gonna go back to the schoolhouse oh shit i've been streaming for three and a half hours uh it's 11 o'clock yeah i think i'm gonna go ahead and log off so when i next time play i'm gonna be going to the schoolhouse and i'll be exploring the basement and then doing other missions that i have let's see, mission three, mission one and two, in and out, and a sample courier, and then mission three. I could, if I headed that way, I could quickly grab that one. A probing move. Yeah. And then fuck that one. M4. What is M4? M4? Yeah, M4 is a heavy helix. Ugh, it's in a painful spot. Little bear. I got the little bear. Anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and end my stream. Thank you for joining. Always carry two boxes of shotgun ammo. Oh, I should definitely do that. That's a good idea. If I'm using shotgun as, like, my primary weapon. Ugh. Oh. Well, and then I have all these mags. Hopefully I find more FMJ so I don't have to steal from there. But anyway. Ah, and thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow, Yod. Uh, I'm going to be ending stream. Let's see. Not worth raiding anybody. So I'm just going to straight end. Thank you for joining. 